God, well, I fought quite hard for it. So, um, so there was this weird thing when you're fighting for a job that you tell people everything that they want to hear in order to try and persuade them that you're right for the job. And, um, and, and then you actually get the job and then you have the crushing reality of having to do it. Uh, but so it was a mixture of great privilege and great responsibility. I was so relaxed at the table. I was like, oh, it's great. No, it's fine. We just get it out of the way and then we can have a drink and it's all fine. And then they said my name and I was sort of like, oh, yeah, well done. Oh, my God, that's my name. <laughs> yeah, it was, um, I, yeah, I'm, I'm in the best sort of shock. I don't even know what you're talking about. You know, I was backstage with the rest of the gang from Fargo because the show had won, you know, so I uh, didn't even know they called my name and somebody poked me, I think Colin Hanks, and said, hey dude, they just called your name. So I ambled out there and muttered something and left. The Golden Globes, there's so many people that I respect it, that are here and it's like to be in front of them and to for have to be a part of Selma and have that be honored and then to have our song be a part of Selma and have that honored, it's like, this is one of the greatest days ever. When it was Prince that came up, I had a, an extra special feeling hearing him call our names and him, hearing him say, of course, glory from Selma. I was so excited. The show is, is it's very funny and it has a lot of light moments and everything, but also the uh, bottom of it is uh, about saving lives. I really just said, I feel like we're like the land of misfit toys and we just got like given away to Christmas, you know, to the best children. You know what I mean? Like, I'm like, what are we doing here? It's really exciting and I think we're all pinching ourselves. It really does make me sentimental because it's really exciting to be able to tell somebody else to go after their dreams because I know I am a testament of someone that has done that. So it's, it's awesome. I, I just knew we were making a great movie, you know? I mean, I knew we had the possibility of making a great movie when I read the script. And then Damien and I did a short film in order to generate income for the feature film. And the short, he put together the short so well that I thought, he's going to really be able to knock it out of the park with the feature. And uh, I just knew every day I went to work and I left thinking, we got a lot of good stuff in the can, and I know that this guy is going to be able to put it together right. Yeah.